The truth shall set you free. This is saying of Christ. Paul goes into death and, and tells us to cling to all that is true and to test everything. Um, now, with evolution, um, not Darwinism, because Darwin got a lot of things wrong. It's like Freud got a lot of things wrong. Now, Freud got, I mean, a lot. I, I don't know. I mean, I think Freud got what most of what he said was incorrect. Yet, he started the field of modern psychiatry, or at least he's credited for it, or made it mainstream, and then you had guys like Hume come, come along, who were a lot closer, who actually took into account the soul, um, and, uh, you know, modern sci um, psychiatry and psychology um, were born and were able to be uh, perfected and actually help people. Um, sometimes they, they do more harm than good, but of, um, of, uh, of evolution, let's say, um, there is microevolution, I don't know if anybody disputes that, um, but macroevolution, I, I don't believe in, um, in the slow mutation thing, I kind of am a Stephen Jay Gould type of guy that believes in jumps, so, um, No, we did not come from apes, right? Not like gorillas or monkeys that you'd see today. Uh, and um, there were different groups of humans, right? Um, I mean, there's a reason why um, Central Africa and uh, Papua New Guinea is uh, inhabited by Bantu um, people, you know? Uh, and uh, why the uh, European Latins of, you know, Italy and uh, southern Spain and um, southern and um, southwestern Portugal uh, have olive skin in that um, people, Swedish people and Nordic people tend to have blonde hair, blue eyes and can get sunburned very easily. Um, you know, there's, and then we see the, uh, the, uh, almond shaped eyes, which, uh, believed were developed, uh, in colder climates, but were retained as those people moved more south and their skin, um, got, uh, in order to combat things like melanoma and sunburn stuff became darker. They didn't become black. They became what people would call red or as a slang yellow skin, more brown toned. Um, so we can see types of evolution there. Even within dog breeds, we can see evolution uh, to a sort like, you know, genetic selection um, and um, reproduction. Um, and that's what I mean by evolution, right? And I do believe that there was a point in history when um, heaven intervened and boom, we have our, our first, you know, humans. On that, I, I still think that um, animals like uh, gorillas, do uh, dogs, and creatures like that do think I don't think it's I think people would just say oh um, human beings are the only thinking animals we're the only ones that dream and all of the animals just rely on instinct I've watched my dogs sleep they dream um, and uh, they think and they can remember so I think it's just a, a kind of a cop-off people say oh yeah well we can eat animals even though we are eat meat eaters I don't deny that I'm not a vegan not a vegetarian. I was a vegetarian for a year when I was younger, but we are omnivores, um, and we do need to eat meat or at least um, ingest a certain animal proteins because there are certain things our body cannot make. Um, and uh, yeah, the um, so this thing about uh, evolution and young Earth creationism, I, I think it's ludicrous because. I've not even met t 
two young earth creationists uh, that that agree with each other. I mean, they'll get in arguments with each other. Uh, and I've even met people who are Christians who claim to be flat earthers, which to me is just, uh, how did the English say, taking the piss? I mean, I think they're just trying to be as controversial as they can, or maybe they're, um, you know,